brave souls have actually decided to be crash test dummies for the Red Bull float tank here today. <laughs> um, crazy, but it's true. Um, the first of which is the Outback Bloomin' Onion. Yes, they've actually built a craft in the shape of a Bloomin' Onion, and they're going to attempt to fly it off our Red Bull float tank flight deck. Don't know how that's going to go. Never seen a Bloomin' Onion fly before. Probably never will. But we'll give them a big cheer. Yes, we'll, 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 we're excited about that. I mean, they're delicious to eat. I love them. We all have them when we go to Outback. But I, when I think of a crab that is going to fly, for some reason, a cut-up onion is not the thing well, I think of. Well, if you look behind you now, Mike, um, you'll see the onion. There we go, folks. We see the onion coming up to the flight deck. Should we be concerned that they had to carry the onion up and it couldn't get up here on its own? It looks pretty well built, Mike. I, I must admit, actually, when I'm looking at it, it looks pretty sturdy. It's I got proper little wheels there on it. We've obviously got the blooming onion coming out the top, and it has wings. It has wings, you which is always it, a good take out. <laughs> So now, do we have the dipping sauce as well? Is that, do we have that? So now, you will have somebody from the Outback team you want to talk to. Um, I'm here with Steve right now. He has a blooming onion on his head. Steve, you're going to be the pilot. So you've actually, I'm going to say, volunteered to get in this giant blooming onion and be pushed off the end of the flight deck there. That'd be right. Uh, some people have told us they don't believe that blooming onions can fly. We're here to prove that it can. So uh, when uh, this onion here flies today, Outback's giving away free blooming onions. Miss coming Tuesday nationwide. So come on in for a blooming onion if we can get this off the flight deck. Now, I'm gonna guess if this does fly, even if it's just two feet, I'm gonna guess where you guys are gonna celebrate. Where are you gonna be? Oh, we're going to Outback tonight. Thank you, <laughs> the Blue <laughs> Red Bull, of course. Red Bull and Bloomin' Onion, sounds like a good match to me. Right, I'll let you get on there. You guys need to get your craft ready. Of course, the other four members of the flight crew are going to be pushing this Bloomin' Onion. All these flight crafts are man-powered, which means that the four crew members, obviously, who are not piloting it, are going to have to run and push as fast as they can, Mike. As fast as they can, because I'll tell you what, speed is your friend here. Yes, speed, speed is, is your friend. Speed is definitely your friend. And already we see it's difficult to get up there. Ladies and gentlemen, you ready to see our first crash go off? Ladies and gentlemen, it's gonna be fun to watch. It's gonna be awesome, but you gotta get hyped. You gotta get loud. You gotta be proud to be part of Miami's first pass. Let me hear you scream! Oh, it's moving slowly but surely. I think this is absolutely hilarious that he's gonna stand on the top of it. I think, Will, I don't know how good of an idea that is to stand. I'm just gonna crawl under the wing. I'm not sure how good an idea any of this is, but they're doing it anyway. <laughs> They're doing it anyway. Are you ready? Are you guys ready? We're ready to do this. They're organizing. They're making their last minute tweaks. Right, guys, no pressure here. First team off the dock. There's only 80,000 people here, so do not feel intimidated at all. Good luck up there. See you guys on the other side. All right, here we go. Are we ready? Ladies and gentlemen, let's see if an onion can fly. On your mark, get set, make some noise. They're making their way down it. Our team is going under the wings. Look at the hangman crew all prepared. They're flying up. We're gonna go, get go, it go, going. Go, go, go. Let's see if we can get flying. Ladies and gentlemen, Blue Talk has begun. Wow, wow. There it is. <laughs> Here we go. Who else is going? Did that answer your question, Mike? Can a blooming onion fly? You know, I'll tell you straight yeah, out. Yeah, team. That blooming onion went about as far as I thought it would go. About nowhere. <laughs> Everybody okay down there? Everybody's being picked up, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up for Outback Steakhouse one time for the blooming onion. Now, Mike, we have got two sets of crash test dummies essentially today. Oh, look at our, let's go up to the big board, check it out. Let's see when he bails on this. He's going down the runway, as you can see right there. He's on the flight deck. And as he gets to the edge, he is going to bail out. He literally goes, oh my god, I got out. He really went nowhere. 
Well, you, what you've got to remember here too, Mike, is, is the distance is actually measured from where the pilot hits the water. So you're going to see a lot of these pilots today attempt to jump out of their craft to get just an extra couple of feet there on the distance points. So it's going to be pretty entertaining to watch that. It's not going to be the last one we're going to see jump from his craft. 